I'm a sucker for love stories and I'm super biased because I'm in this one. Um, but it's uh, beautiful. It's a, a story about two sort of broken human beings coming together and trying to find out who they are as individuals and together. They run into each other at a party and uh, Adam is, I think that, you know, he wasn't really looking for anything. He wasn't really trying to find love or a relationship or anything because there are a lot of ways in which he's very closed off to intimacy. Um, but it's, it's almost like a, a love at first sight thing that happens. Jenny is a single mom and she's been burned a bunch in the past and she's had all of these really horrible relationships and she meets this sweet and super gentle and kind man and throughout the course of the play is trying so desperately to figure out in her own limited way what is happening and, and why this person who seems to love her so much continues to withdraw into, into this past. It's this love story with ghosts, we call it, right? Adam would love to not have that history. He would love to just not have that past and be able to just enter this relationship unencumbered when he can. There is something sweeping and romantic in this everyday story about a family fighting for love and these two people fighting for love and this boy fighting for acceptance. I hope that audiences take away a feeling of love, that a, a feeling of optimism and hope that our, our destinies are shaped by our choices and the choices that the people around us make count, but it, at the end of the day it's, it's about you and it's about me and it's about the way that we choose to live our lives.